there, welcome to my channel. My name is Missy and as always, I'm so happy that you're here with me today. If you're new here, welcome. I do hope you subscribe and become part of my YouTube family. I would love to have you. And if you already do subscribe, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. And uh, it does not go unnoticed, all the support that you give me and I love you all. So, like I said, I did a lot of shopping at Dollarama and I have split my um, items up into different hauls and uh, I think I got some pretty good stuff to show you today. So let's get into this haul uh, from Dollarama. So the first thing I picked up was this body wash and it's shea and vanilla and it's by Ren Pure. And in my last haul, I got the conditioner. Um, I have not tried it yet. I forgot all about it this morning. And uh, anyways, uh, I'm going to try this and let you know uh, what it's uh, all about and how it is. But uh, this was $4 and uh, the conditioner I bought in my last haul was $30.22 on Amazon. And we paid $4 for that. And uh, I found this uh, online this morning. I think it was Amazon and uh, it was about $20.22 or something like that and I paid $4 for this. So uh, we're going to give this a try. I haven't smelled it yet. Oh, it smells divine. It really smells nice. So uh, I will try that uh, this week and I will let you know. But $4, what a great deal. We will take that all day long. Yes, we will. Yes. So the next thing I got, and nothing is in order, this was $3.50. And uh, it says, I love gardening from head to my toes. And uh, I absolutely love this mug. They are getting some really nice mugs in. And uh, this one, I don't know if you can see it, but it has a little shovel at the very bottom. And uh, I am going to use this later because I do have a drink that I want to try. But uh, absolutely love this. They have lots of gardening uh, mugs there. And uh, yes, the Gifted Gardener. Yes, absolutely love it. And they have different colors there too. So the next thing I got, I think I might have tried this like years ago, like I mean many years ago, but I saw it there the other day and it's Maxwell House Coffee French Vanilla. And uh, we are gonna try that in our mug or uh, maybe I'll do it in a glass mug so that you can see the actual color of it. Um, but if I remember correctly, this is pretty good, but we are going to give it a try today. And I believe I paid $3 for this. And uh, yeah, love my coffee. Absolutely love my coffee. Okay. So the next thing I got, my family loves these. Um, I may try these today for you. It's been a long time since I've tried these, but they're the mini croissants. And I'm sure you see them at your Dollarama all the time. They always seem to have them. And uh, I don't have these on my receipt uh, that I have in front of me, but I think they were about $2, something like that. They weren't a lot of money, but uh, I really like these. I like to have egg salad or corned beef or something like that on these. It's just a really nice bite, good for lunch. The next thing I got, and I have never tried potato chips from Dollarama. I see them hauled all the time, and my favorite kind of chip is ketchup. So for $2, I got these uh, ketchup... Um, D gourmet uh, potato chips and we're going to try those today because I love a ketchup chip I don't eat them often because if I start I will eat the whole bag I love them that much so we'll see if they are as good as Lay's um, uh, they don't have to be exactly like Lay's but uh, if they taste something like that then I'll probably love them so we're going to try those today for sure the next thing I got um, I picked up because of the, the uh, flavor of them. I've never had one of these bear paws and uh, I think they were, they were $2.25 and you get five packages of them and they're the molasses and I love molasses cookies and that's why I picked them up and they're by Dare and we're gonna give those a try today too. Yes, I love the taste test. I get to have my snacks. The um. Next thing I picked up, I had not seen at my Dollarama, I got these at a different one, and uh, there's four glass straws in this package, and I paid $2 for them, and uh, I love a reusable straw, and uh, like I said, I've, I have bamboo ones, I have silicone ones, but I do not have the glass ones, and I think I'm going to like these way better than the other ones, um, so I can't wait to give these a try, and I do believe they come with a little cleaner too. Yeah. 
two dollars for those and they were in the kitchen section the next thing i got is for my daughter because i bought these before and she loves them and they were only a dollar 25 and they're the sesame breadsticks um, she finished the box off last night and uh, said, oh, mom, are you going to go to Dollarama and get some more? And I said, I already have them. So uh, I'll give these to her today. She loves them. Absolutely loves the breadsticks from Dollarama. So the next thing I got, and I have seen these hauled, and uh, I finally found a Dollarama that had them. And they were $1.25, which is really reasonable for a little sign like this. This one says love. I absolutely love this. So, so cute. I'll probably hang them in the front hallway, but $1.25, you know, that's a pretty good price for those, especially at Dollarama. And this one says, grow with love, and this one's really pretty too with the succulent here. And uh, yes, we love those. Probably hang them up today. The next thing I got was uh, Necessity, and uh, I think they were $1.25 or $1.50. $1.50 and they're just these zipper seal bags. I used my last one a couple of days ago and there's 20 of them in here. And we use a lot of these Ziploc bags. Um, I used my last one to freeze spaghetti sauce. So the next thing I have, these were $1.50 and they're a removable hook and uh, holds up to uh, 250 grams. So uh, they're great for your keys or something like that. I do have key holders at the front door, but um, I might use these for something else. But I thought they were kind of neat. They were new at my store and uh, yeah, not a bad price either. The next thing I got, I got for my daughter because she never ever charges her phone. She always forgets and then uh, I can't get a hold of her or she can't get a hold of me. So this was $4 and it's a battery pack. And uh, I got her a pink one. So I guess um, you charge this and then you just throw it in your purse. And if you need to plug your phone in, it has a charge. I think that's how it works. But $4 for that, I don't know what they cost at like Best Buy or something like that. But when I saw this, um, I had to have it for her. Um, and uh, I showed it to her and she agrees that she needs to have this. And uh, they are getting some great electronics in at Dollarama. You just have to make sure you take your time and look around. Um, I don't think I, I saw these at my Dollarama, but I picked them up at a different one. And uh, yes, I might go back and get another one for myself. Just to have if I'm on the road and forgot to plug my phone in or something like that. So these were, how much were these? These were $3 and these are new to my Dollarama and they're handy pockets, multi-purpose and uh, they don't bunch up and they have two sides. So I use a fiber cloth to do my dusting and um, these are great. I was so happy to see these if I can get them apart. So that's what they look like and uh, you just put your hand in. Isn't that something? I absolutely love this. Uh, this is going to be great for dusting, which I'm going to be doing later on today. And uh, yeah, and you can use both sides. You can just turn it around and use that side as well. Throw it in the washer and uh, you're good to go. So these were in um, just past the kitchen, kind of where all the sponges and stuff are. But uh, yeah, handy pockets. Absolutely love these. If I like them, I'm going to go back and buy some more because these would be great to use at the cottage when we're out there cleaning the cottages. Um, yeah, like I said, I use a fiber cloth, but it always bunches up and uh, I'm, I, I don't really like them, but this I will absolutely like. Yes, I will. And uh, you know, for $3, yes, we'll take that. The next thing I got, I thought I had seen all the napkins for uh, Easter. Apparently I did not because I went to a different Dollarama and I found these. And there's 24 of them and they were $1.50. And I love a napkin that has a cutout shape. This one's an egg and it's so vibrant and so nice and I absolutely love this. And the next one is the carrot. Isn't this cute? I don't even wanna use them. I will use them, but I don't want to. They're just so cute. Yes, and we go through a lot of napkins in this house. And uh, when I saw these, I was super excited to see them because like I said, I thought I saw all of the napkins for Easter. 
My Dollarama didn't have them, but another Dollarama did. So that was pretty good. The next thing I got, uh, I didn't get at my Dollarama. I got at a different Dollarama, and I had not seen these before. And I worked at the bulk barn, and these bags cost a pretty penny when I worked there. And this is a set of four reusable snack and sandwich bags. Fill, eat, and repeat. And uh, that's what they look like. So uh, these ones here are just smaller, and then you have the bigger one behind. So there's four of them, two of these and two of these. And these are perfect for my daughters to take uh, lunch in to work. They can just bring them home, reuse them, no waste at all. And like I said, if you go to a different store, you're paying a lot more for these. And they're very cute, they're pink. The other ones they had um, were cute for kids. They had like a monster on the front, like a cartoon monster. And uh, so, so cute. And uh, yeah, absolutely love them. And uh, I think, I think I said they were $4. Yeah, $4 for those. What a steal. Um, these are not going to last long. I can tell you that. I showed my daughter who also worked at the bulk barn with me. And uh, she said, I can't believe you got four bags for $4. So uh, I may go back and get some more because like I said, they're just perfect. If you go on a road trip or, uh, you know, work or anything like that, you can just throw a snack or your lunch in. Perfect for our family. The next thing I got, I told you in the last haul, I got the um, Snoopy or Peanuts um, oven mitts. And these are the other ones that go kind of with them. And it says, go sliding. Sure, why not? And uh, so, so cute. Yes. And they also have the really nice grip here. And I have pretty small hands, so these kind of oven mitts are perfect for me. But uh, I have so many oven mitts. I mean, I have so many. So I don't know if I'll keep these or give them away. Maybe I'll do a giveaway or something like that. Um, uh, again, after the giveaway is over. I do have a giveaway going on right now. If you haven't checked that video out, I invite you to check it out. And uh, leave a comment and get um, in on that giveaway. But uh, I could always keep these for another giveaway. I think they're super nice. They make a nice little gift for sure. Okay. The next thing I got, I got in the electrics uh, department or aisle too, and it was $2, and it's a stylus pen for your phone or your tablet, and um, I really like this. Um, at night, when I'm laying in bed, I turn the TV off, sometimes I'll go on my phone, and it's just really nice to have something like this, and uh, I might get one for everyone in the house for $2. It's, it's not a bad price at all. And uh, yeah, so the next thing I got... This says long lasting results and it's a pro performance facial hair remover. And it moves, removes the hair from the root. And it's got a little coil on it here. And uh, I don't know if I can get it out. I didn't bring a knife in. We'll get it out. There we go. So I wouldn't use something like this because it terrifies me. Um, to rip hair out of my face. It terrifies me, but my daughter saw this and she's like, I will take that if you're not going to use it. But I guess you just like roll it around your face and it um, pulls out um, the hair. But uh, she said she would take it, so it does have a use. I'm happy about that. And uh, the last thing in the bag, I do have something else to show you, but the last thing in the bag, I could not resist. And I think they had these last year. But it's this little camper and I'm going to paint it probably white, pink and turquoise. Um, I'm going to use I'm going to paint that this afternoon. And then in my next video, I'll show you uh, what it looks like. But um, I thought what a cute little project. And of course, I would not put this outside. It would probably get wrecked uh, immediately. It's not like super well made or anything like that. But I might uh, put it on a shelf or something like that. But uh, I thought it was really cute and uh, I can't wait to paint that today. So, the next thing that I got, the last thing that I'm going to show you, I have seen these hauled, I have, and there's a big controversy whether they're uh, sold individual or they are sold by the box. Um, they each have a SKU number on them, but they are actually supposed to be sold by the box. And uh, I had a lovely girl helping me at Dollarama, um, was it yesterday when I popped in, and uh Anyways, uh, they are the fairy bath bombs, and there's eight of them in here, 
and uh, they spin. Let me see. I'm gonna put my glasses on. Floats and spins, and uh, they are island hibiscus, and they smell divine. Yes, they do, and they have these little um, sequins in here, and uh, apparently they spin, and uh, the sequins is in your bath, and it's just a really nice experience. I've seen some YouTubes on these, and they look really fun. So uh, I was excited that um, I could get the whole package for $4. Um, I think they're probably, like I've looked them up, they're about $4, $5 each at Walmart or whatever. But anyways, Dollarama is selling them by the container. So if you see these, um, grab the whole container, they're $4. Um, so that's like 50 cents each. So I'm pretty happy to have that, pretty excited. The girls wanted to get into them last night and I said, just let me haul them and then you can have them. But uh, I will be using one of these tonight just to see if I like it. But the smell, and, and even watching the video on uh, YouTube, it just looks like a lot of fun. Yes. So I was pretty, pretty excited to get those. Yes. So I am going to go and make a coffee. I'm going to go make this. I think I'll put it in my clear uh, coffee mug so that you can see the color of it. And then we'll come back and try a couple of these snacks. So I will be right back. Okay, I'm back and I've made myself an international coffee, vanilla, and uh, we're going to give it a try. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. Yes, I love this. Mmm. So good. Absolutely wonderful. My youngest daughter is probably going to finish that off. She loves a good French vanilla. Absolutely loves a French vanilla. Next, we're going to try one of these little buns. Like I said, I have had these before. Um, I'm trying them for you. Uh, they're just so cute. And I love corned beef. Mixed with a little bit of mayo and some relish on one of these buns. So, so good. So I'm just going to break a piece off. Mmm. Mmm. They are fabulous. If you haven't tried these yet, grab yourself a bag. They're good with just uh, some butter, um, but really good with an egg salad or corned beef or cold cuts. It's just the perfect little sandwich to have for lunch. You could pack it in one of those reusable bags and uh, take it with you. But these are amazing. Really, really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm going to try the chips. I don't have high expectations because I really do love a Lay's ketchup chip, but I'm going to try these dollar store chips for the first time. So uh, that's what they look like. You actually get quite a few. They smell so good. They smell like my favorite ketchup chips. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I love a ketchup chip. These are so good for $2. I saw Lay's chips the other day, two for $8, and I refused to pay that. Um, absolutely. These were $2. I can't believe it. Oh, they're so good. Just one more. Mmm. Mmm. Yay! If you like Lay's chips and you like the ketchup ones, buy these at Dollarama. Save yourself some money. They are divine. I'm so happy that I bought them. I walk by them all the time thinking they're probably not going to be very good. But, you know, now that I'm trying a lot of food from Dollarama... I thought, why not try the chips? And uh, I am so glad that I did. Yes, absolutely. So happy that I bought them. Mm. Oh, that coffee. Okay, so the last thing we're going to try are these bear paws. And they're individually wrapped. And I have seen these for years. Absolutely. Uh, everywhere I go. And uh, that's what the packaging looks like. You could just throw that in your purse and away you go. 
even some molasses that got me. So you get two in a package. That's what, aren't they cute? They're so cute. It's not a strong uh, molasses uh, smell, but let's try it and see if we like it. Mmm. Just to be sure, one more piece. Mmm. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. 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 So so good. They are fantastic. It's just a mild flavor of molasses. It's not overpowering at all. They're super soft, like really soft. Um I believe they're really for kids. I mean, um, but I'm a big kid, so I can eat them too. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 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 Mmm. I'm going to hide those too. I was, my whole closet's full of things I'm hiding. Like those, those chocolate covered wafers that I hauled last haul, they're almost gone. Um, but I will be hiding these. Yes, I will. And then if I go on a road trip or something, I can just throw one in my purse. Absolutely love the cookie. Yes. So that's all I have for you today. Um, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please subscribe and hit that like button. And I hope you have a fantastic day. Until next time, bye for now.